You don't have to pack a giant rucksack to find adventure because it can also be experienced when you meet someone and explore their personality and inner beauty. That's what photographer Shazan Waggy sets out to do when she captures an image, as she explained to Karishma. It isn't unusual to see photographers at work outside the High Court, but this was no paparazza behind the lens. Play with a jacket, nice. They say that a photograph should capture the soul, not just a smile. And my next guest happens to capture both beautifully, and I cannot wait to meet her. Over the shoulder. Okay, walk towards me, and then you're gonna do a nice spin. And spin, and look at me, look down over your shoulder. Hi Shazan, how are you? I'm fine, thanks, and you? Good, thank you. What are you busy with at the moment? We are shooting a street style fashion look. We're shooting it in town because of the street style of the model. And we're just going to walk around and look at the different walls and the textures that we can shoot with and see how it goes with the looks. I book a lot of street style shoots. Any tips? Yes, yeah, sure. There's a nice wall around the corner. We can shoot there if you'd like. That sounds fantastic. Let's, Let's go. go. Sort of go. Okay, guys, so I really love this wall. And I think this is a perfect location for us to do our next shot. Should we do it? Yes, let's do it. Okay, Sara. So you're just going to stand with your leg on the wall. And just give me a nice strong face. That looks beautiful. Thanks, Sara. It's been amazing. I think it's time for Karishma to take your place and let's see how you do. I'm not sure I can follow that act, but let's <laughs> give it a try. <laughs> Okay, Shazan, what do you want? Do you want a sexy pout? Do you want very serious? <laughs> I'm just pulling all the tricks out of the bag here. You direct. Okay, let's start with a simple pose. Okay. You're going to put your hand on your hip and bring your shoulder forward like this and connect your chin with your shoulder. And bring your chin down and give me a nice strong eyes. Maybe turn your back towards the wall and then just lean on it. Okay. And you're just going to relax and look at me. And you can bring the hair up like that, stunning. Wow, Karishma, you really are such a natural. Oh, thank the you. The pictures came out amazing. Do you want to have a look? I'd love to. Let me help you. Thank you. Oh, wow, that was a beautiful... I love that one. Shazan, your love for photography started at a very young age. I was about 9 or 10 when I started shooting. Um, my dad bought me a film camera and I used to take it with me to school. And I would shoot my friends and use them as models and shoot anything and everything at school. That's really where my passion sparked and it was such an amazing feeling when my dad used to develop all the pictures for me. And um, after that I went straight on to digital and I had a small um, digital camera and I used to shoot with that. So that's where everything started. How do you go about then turning that passion into a career? I started building a portfolio for myself and from there I would shoot with models from agencies and I uploaded it on my Facebook page and it developed into an actual job for me. What style of photography do you love the most? My style of photography is very modern, elegant and I try to get natural poses out of my clients and I try to make it something that's fine art that they can use to put up on their walls as canvases or photo books and I try to create memories for them. So for me, my style would be timeless. I've also seen some amazing glam shots from you. Well, I love making women feel good about themselves and I feel that it's such an amazing confidence booster for them to come in and um, we show them a completely different side um, to them and they really appreciate that. Now, photography is your first love, but do you have any other loves in your life? Definitely my family, my little girls and my husband. Would you like to meet them? I would love that. Let's go. Cape Town's famous inner city green space is a favourite place for Shazan and Junaid's two daughters to meet friends who wear feathers and fur. You are so cute! <laughs> Shazan, are you one of those moms that take copious amounts of pictures of their children? Yes, I definitely am. But she I think lots of pictures, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but I think they're so used to it now and they actually enjoy being in front of the camera. What do you think makes Shazan an amazing photographer without being too biased? To me, she's the best photographer in Cape Town and she's my wife and I'm really proud of her. <laughs> what a beautiful answer. Shazan, how has being a mom affected your career? Well, being a mom and being an entrepreneur, you have to be able to juggle um, work and family life. 
And um, the most important thing to me is spending quality time with my family um, and putting in the hours with regards to my business to make sure all my clients are happy. Well, your kids are doing some pretty cute stuff right now, so don't you want to go take some pics? Yes, sure, let's go. Okay. Look, at, look at each other, girls. Look at me, look at me. Tickle Daddy girls, come on, Tickle Daddy! <laughs> tickle Daddy! <laughs> <laughs> that is so cute. Well, life is like a camera. Focus on what's important and you'll capture it beautifully. Shazan certainly has a focus spot on.